Being the one at the helm of affairs at the agency Nigeria depends upon to ensure safety in the consumption of wholesome foods, Drug Administration and Control is not an easy task. But the Director General of NAVDAC, Professor Mojisola Deyeye, has now handled the assignment for three years. Health correspondent Jacqueline Ogo in this report takes a look at some impressive steps she has taken so far. For the Director General of NAVDAC, three years is the beginning of a yet stronger determination to ensure Nigerians consume safe foods and drugs, amongst other products, as well as export such in internationally acceptable standards to boost national revenue. To this end, Professor Mojisola Adeyeye has improved NAVDAC's quality management system and upgraded its seven laboratories, with five now operating with cutting-edge equipment to ensure data integrity. This has made the agency get the tick of the World Health Organization for meeting its global benchmark on best practice. In three years, Professor Adeyeye has these feathers to add to her cap. She ensured the payment of over 3.2 billion naira owed the federal government in remittances by NAVDAC shortly after assuming office. She also sought to eat that NAVDAC returned to the nation's pots to block illegalities in the importation and exportation of products under her watch. When we realized that even the importers had gained information that we were monitoring them, we were able to see how they went about transloading those containers on the IC from ship to ship in order to change the identifying vessel. The NAVDAC DG has also introduced drug traceability programs for better tackling of fake drugs. NAVDAC is adopting the use of the Med Safety app because NAVDAC has been part and parcel of the international drug monitoring uh, body that WHO set up. Within three years in office, Professor Mojisola Adeyeye has seen to the confiscation but of 45 containers of tramadol worth 1.7 trillion naira from 2019 till date. NAVDAC has made the registration of small and medium-scale enterprises easier, improved on its organizational capacity, but says it needs more operational vehicles and equipment to make it easier to clamp down more effectively on fake drugs manufacturers and traders in all areas of the country. Jacqueline Ogo, TVC News, Lagos.